Hello friends, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Anshuman. Today I am going to try out Dal Puri from Annapurna Sweets, which is located in Chitranjan Park Market Number Two. Google location is in description box. Please do check that. To reach Chitranjan Park Market Number Two, you have to deboard at Greater Kailash Metro Station. From there, you have to take an auto, or you can also take electronic rickshaw. They will charge you around ten to twenty rupees. I mean, the auto will charge you around. 40 rupees and the electronic rickshaw will charge you around 10 to 20 rupees. India is not only about population; it is more than that. It is about history, different cultures, different cuisines, and that is why it is very tricky situation for a foodie like me. Because half of the time I'm confused what to eat and what not to. Why? Because India has a long list of different cuisines. Today I'm having dal puri, which is a type of flat bread and a part of Bengali cuisine. It slowly became popular in Bihar and some parts of Uttar Pradesh. I believe wherever Bengali speaking people migrated along with their bags, they also carried their recipes. Friends, this dal puri history is very confusing or rather interesting. It is still not researched well. There are no proper evidence from where it has originated. But as per my knowledge goes, during the British rule, many labors from India were sent to countries like Mauritius West Indies by ships for work purpose, and those labors used to carry fixed amount of food such as wheat, refined flour, chana dal, along with fresh water. Fresh water was needed to prepare a dough made up of refined wheat flour. So, due to these limited resources, it is possible that one of the labors must have mixed chana dal along with refined wheat flour to create one dish with two ingredients. And later started the concept in Bengal as well. Another interesting thing, dal puri is one of the best-selling street food in Mauritius. And if you ever visit West Indies as well, you will still find restaurants selling dal puri. Oh, there is one documentary. Unfortunately, I don't have that access to that. But if you are watching my video, if you are watching Guide Da from outside India, then please search dal puri diaspora by Richard Fung. The one which I ate today from Annapurna Sweets, Chitranjan Park Market Number Two, is made up of refined wheat flour, chana dal, and it goes well with aloo sabji. Annapurna Sweets dal puri is not deep fried; it is rather pan fried, and it is very soft. Even old age people can enjoy this food. About the aloo sabji, it is not spicy. So if you are watching my video from outside India, then please be rest assured you can visit this store. I paid rupees fifty for this meal, and this is a breakfast meal. Only available on Saturday and Sunday from 9 a.m. till 10:30 a.m. IST. But I would recommend you all visit before 10:30 a.m. because they are really popular. So many customers do visit. Apart from dal puri, you can enjoy varieties of sweets such as mishti doi, chandesh, white rasgulla, and it is summer season in India, so you can try out the seasonal sweet special mango rasgulla. Ah, that is the end of this video. I had an awesome dal puri experience at Annapurna Sweets, Chitranjan Park Market Number Two. Google location in the description box. If you all want to see similar informative videos, then please like, share, subscribe to my channel Guide Da, and don't forget to press the bell icon for notifications. Till then, please take care. Thank you.